Hey everyone, Anton again from Pocket Now, Michael behind the camera, and today we're comparing the LG Optimus G Pro with the Samsung Galaxy Note 2, probably close competitors in the future. We have 5.5 inch displays, both on left and the right, but the LG Optimus G Pro features a 1080p display versus the 720p display on the Samsung Galaxy Note. Now in terms of raw horsepower, the LG Optimus G Pro features a Qualcomm Snapdragon 600 quad-core processor clocking in at 1.7 GHz, while we have a Exynos processor quad-core still running at 1.6 on the Samsung Galaxy Note. Now, another difference between those is the camera, which I'll flip to the back. You'll see a 13 megapixel camera with the LG Optimus G Pro, but only an eight megapixel camera on the Samsung Galaxy Note 2. But, however, the Note 2 has an edge. It has the S Pen, which is right here. On the LG Optimus G Pro, you will have to use your finger as the pen once you activate QMemo and you write on the screen, erase, and just go nuts with taking notes. Now, in terms of build quality, both of these feel the same in the hand. They're plastic both. Obviously, we have a brushed aluminum type of finish on the Galaxy Note 2. We have the same plastic. It feels like the hyperglaze plastic. Of course, hyperglazing is a Samsung thing, but they feel exactly the same in the hand. We have the Nexus 4-like squares here going in the, in the background. And uh, in terms of tallness, you can see that they're approximately the same. They're quite exactly the same height. I'm gonna, just going to turn them to their side so you can see that they are exactly the same thickness too. However, the Galaxy Note 2 is this much wider than the Samsung, uh, than the I'm sorry, LG Optimus G Pro, which accounts for approximately two to three millimeters. Now let's take a look at a couple of software differences. So while on the LG Optimus G Pro, you can uh, basically activate the. Uh, Q slide feature to have several applications on top of each other. Basically, this one on top of the layer on the background. The Galaxy Note 2 has multi window support, which is, I believe, a little bit cooler because you can drag two different applications and have it split display on the same display size between any two applications which are supported. The Q slide feature on the LG Optimus G only supports a couple of applications like the included messaging applications, email applications, internet calculator, and so on. So another difference is that the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 has a removable battery right here. The Optimus G Pro, while you can peel the cover off to access the back to insert the micro SD card, you cannot remove the battery. However, the battery is one of 3140 milliamp hours. It's, let's say, the same as the one on the uh, Galaxy Note 2, so it will basically come down to the fact that the Qualcomm processor might or might not be more power efficient than Samsung's Exynos processor. So this was a quick look at the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 versus the LG Optimus G Pro. I'm Anton from Pocket Now. We have Michael behind the camera. Thank you very much for watching and stay tuned for more coverage from Barcelona MWC 2013.